rallying back to racing once again and it's the round of the Italian Touring Car Championship from Vallalunga, the start of the first race and we're on board with Emanuele Naspetti as we head off down towards the first corner but it's the former Grand Prix driver Stefano Modena who is leading the race up in front in the number nine Alpha. Oh, somebody's got their door open and that is uh, Tedeschi who has uh, found that his door is flying open. Let's hope that uh, that doesn't cause too many problems for the rest of the opposition. Somebody blowing up that uh, Russo in the number 59 car. But this the battle for second place developing. Tamburini getting hit by the Audi of Emanuele Piro there. And uh, this the battle for second as they chase after Stefano Modena. There goes Modena, Tamburini, former winner in the championship so far this year, being chased by Emanuele Piro in the Audi. The Audi has had a good run of success in this Italian series. As we're on board with Vitali, and oh, there's been a big accident. A big accident in front of Tamara Vitali, the lady racer in the Alpha, and that is Alex Bergstaller in the BMW. Well, the race stopped, so uh, we see a restarted race now with Stefano Modena leading once again good start for him once again as battles going on down the order Giovanardi coming under pressure from Roberto Ravaglia Ravaglia who made a visit flying visit to the British Touring Car Series a couple of weekends ago at Donington Park for BMW he's just managed to find his way past the Peugeot of Fabrizio Giovanardi back up front once again and we can see Emanuele Piros finds a way past Tamburini so Piro up into second place now as we see there, the number seven car of Johnny Cicotto, the other BMW in the race. But uh, it's Ravaglia who's managed to get his BMW right up on terms with Emanuele Pido in second for Piro, third for Ravaglia, but the race leader still Stefano Modena in the uh, Alpha up front. Piro comes down the inside. This is a challenge for the race lead. Piro trying to get the Audi down the inside of the Alpha, but he doesn't quite manage it. So Modena continues to lead as they con complete another lap of the Vallalunga circuit. Former Grand Prix driver Stefano Modena up against uh, Emanuele Piro, another former Formula One driver. Piro with uh, experience with Benetton, with Scuderia Italia. He's trying to get up the inside. No, oh, there's contact between the two of them. Big hit there and indeed... Biro, is he going to take the lead? No, Modena comes back at him. So Modena still somehow retains the overall lead. And these two <laughs> ex-Formula 1 drivers involved in a very, very tight and close tussle all the way to the chequered flag. But it is Modena who wins it from in second place, Emanuele Piro. So on to the second race. No uh, rest here as we're into race two and on the board again with Emanuele Naspetti in uh, the BMW. Modena once again to the fore and uh, takes the lead of the race as the Peugeot both battling away a bit further down the order. Modena from Piro, from Capello, from Tamburini and then uh, Chicotto, the two Alf, the two Peugeots rather of Giovanardi and Gary Ailes, the British driver in the Peugeot team on the oil there but it manages to get him past the second of the Alphas that look like Tamburini. Oh, Gary Ailes goes off a bit wide there on the grass for the Briton and uh, that's lost him perhaps a little bit of ground on his teammate as uh, going through goes uh, that's Brand going past the number five car Tamano Vidali and there is Roberto Rivalli I think fighting his way up and uh, we go back towards the battle for the lead as Piro once again goes down the inside of Modena but uh, once again there's contact between the two of them this is getting a bit frantic between these two Piro squeezes down the inside and finally gets past Modena but it's been hard aggressive racing from both these drivers and Capello now has come up into third position a little bit further back the battle of the BMWs we've got uh, Chicotto versus Ravaglia there Johnny Chicotto behind Capello Ravaglia comes down the inside of Chicotto takes that place away so Ravaglia in the number one CBM BMW the reigning Italian champion gets past Johnny Chicotto in the Bugatti car and Ravaglia now coming up the up to get alongside Capello. Ravaglia taking Ronaldo Capello. I think he's going to get past. Yes, he does indeed get past. So Ravaglia flying now. He's up into third place and chasing after Stefano Modena. So is Piro up front. Modena in second place and Ravaglia in third position. As Ravaglia, oh, Ravaglia locks up and clouds Modena. A hefty whack there. Gets through, but my word. That was a little bit out of order and he's got bodywork rubbing on his tyre now and that certainly could cause a few problems. It really has been a bruising and battering Italian Touring Car Championship. A couple of races here at Vallalunga. Ravaglia 
smoke pouring off that tyre now and really it looks unlikely that that tyre is going to make it all the way to the finish. Piro, our race leader, that is still the battle going on between Capello and Chicotto for third, fourth position now. Fourth place battle between the Audi and the BMW but race winner Emanuele Piro coming through to take a second victory, well in fact the first win here at Vallelunga and a victory for him, second for Modena, third for Capello, Chicotto fourth and Giovinardi in fifth.